Hello friends, welcome to JavaFX GUI tutorial. In this sub-series, we are going to create a uh, simple sample to learn about the pie chart. In this specific video, we will learn about the pie chart. Then we will create a sample application as shown here in the left side screenshot. So user will enter the product name then they will enter sales so you can take it in any way sales in a week or month or year likewise they can add multiple products and the data is shown here and the same data can be represented graphically using the pie chart here product maybe here we provided a title right product sales in a year so by looking at the pie chart here you can clearly say that cycle is the product which sold more than all other product category and the least one that was sold is bikes right likewise we can represent the data A pi is simply a circle representing 360 degree. So that's what we call right phi and it will represent a circle. So it goes all, all the way to 360 degree. Alright. So a phi is simply a circle representing 360 degree. We can divide it into slices to represent a measured variant. We previously saw that, right? So, for example, if uh, this is the circle and this is the center, you can divide these into slices. Say, for example, here we have three slices. This is slice one, slice two, and slice three. So, pi is a circle representing 360 degree and when we divide that into uh, different angles we will be getting the slices so using the slice we can represent a variant say for example in the previous screenshot we saw sales of some product right product one sold this much product two and this is product 3 so 50 percentage of sales is on product 3 and the remaining is shared by product 1 and product 2 so here we are representing the data in terms of slices when there are many slices the measured item show the weightage in relation to other item here you can see 3 has more weightage, maybe 50 to 60 percent, and 2 is very less weightage compared to 3. The intermediate weightage is given to uh, slice 1. So, this is in relation, right? 3 in relation to 2 is high. So, it clearly shows you the weightage in relation to other item. The slice in pie chart can be represented via pie chart dot data class. So the measured variant here, say for example, if it is a sales of different bicycles, that's the measured variant as well as uh, how much sales. So both we can represent using the data class that's available inside the pie chart. Pie chart data, this one. takes two params one is measured item say for example bike measured value say for example how much is the sales 400 right likewise you can put a number of uh, um, data items 20 30 or 5 whatever data item you want to add you can add it then pie chart will take care of uh, 
showing the relational information like what you see here in the next video we will design f fxml to explore pie chart and how it works that's all here in this video thank you for watching bye